A good morning, Church. Uh, it's beautiful to be in this morning and to be, uh, I think, with God uh, this time. And just wanted to share one thought about uh, the Word of God. In Psalms 19, there are 14 verses in this psalm. And uh, this uh, psalm is written by David. And the first six verses talks about the God, the general revelation. By looking at the creation, man can know that there is a creator behind it. But then from the verse 17, 7 onwards, the writer is pointing to the special revelation, that is the word of God. By looking at the word, we can come to the conclusion that who God is and what he has done. And this is so important and because the psalmist says in verse 7, the law of the Lord is perfect, converting the soul. And uh, this is like a, when our soul is illuminated, when the when we hear the word of God, which is preached, and our soul is get a, like when we then we mix that word with uh, faith, Hebrews chapter four verse two, and uh, it is like a now transformed, it converts the soul. It has a power. It has so powerful to when I mix that word with faith, simple faith. And it uh, converts my soul. It uh, it uh, it just quickens. <coughs> it quickens me. It energizes me. It gives me new motivation. And it ha I have a God's like a, the God is in my thoughts. And this is so important as we come to this uh, uh, this this way of thinking. Hebrews chapter four to mix faith with what they what you hear from the word of God. Years back, I had a sickness and uh, of a TB, and then I had to take the medicine every day and uh, night, day and night, and week after week, month, and it's a long time, longer period of time, almost a year. I had to take, and uh, I discipline, I discipline myself to take that, uh, those medications because I wanted to be healed, and it happened. I did that, and. Uh, I think they, like just wanted to bring that uh, similarity like I need to take the word every day day after day because there are many infections can come in our soul because of what happened to us and uh, because uh, like Job says that the arrows of the Almighty have pierced my soul and I drink the poison and uh, those poison infections in my soul I need to be healed in that uh, how can we heal Yes, we need, when this is the word of God, converts the soul. And uh, it says that because making wise the simple, I need, Lord, help me. And when you hear the word today, I just want to give a practice, like when today when you hear the word from God, mix faith with that. Mix faith. With it. And this goes day after day. And what happens? You are like, your life has been transformed. We don't know how it happened, but we know this, this is the truth. And this can happen in our life. And um, just uh, think with these thoughts, the word of the Lord. In Numbers 32, and uh, we were studying yesterday in the class, and the people of Israel, after 40 years of wanderings, and this is a new generation, they are about to enter the promised land. They are at the border of the Jordan River. But the two and a half tribes said, no, we are going to settle on this side of Jordan. If you know that map, you know that Jordan River. And then this uh, Transjordan area, this area, we are going to, because we have so much of cattle. That statement displeased Moses. Moses said, like, I, inf like, I'm just making a statement. I myself wanted to cross the Jordan. I pleaded with the Lord, but God told me, you will not go to that promised land. But these people, though they have an opportunity, though they have everything, they have authority, but they said, no, we are going to settle on this side of Jordan. And uh, they settled there, the two and a half tribe, Reuben, Gad, and a half tribe of Manasseh. Because, but then we see that in the history, and they were the first, the people who, when the enemy attacked, they went into captivity. Because they're not willing to cross the Jordan. But I think today, as we face many challenges, let's mix faith with the word which we hear from God do this and we will see that amazing transformation. We see that our soul is healed. I am no more negative. 
like I'm no more like a like a bitter but I can like when I hear of forgiveness mix faith with what I am here as I when I hear about praising God I mix faith with what we hear and uh, and the doctrine and this doctrine converts converts our soul and I'm my heart is now fixed I don't need it now any other external elements like people in the world go for drugs and other stuff to be in a sublimate or to 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 uh, energize to revitalize their uh, their life but we need the word of god by the power of the holy spirit and this is amazing that we have a great privilege we have a great opportunity today this morning this day and any other day and to be mix hear god mix faith with it may god bless this morning father we pray uh, this time and uh, for our people lord help us we need to hear your word discern your word and then mix faith with what we hear we also lord pray for our church people we pray for anyuta lord prashant and uh, uh, the family lord we just asking today akanksha prashant and akanksha lord we pray for uh, their baby lord admitted in the hospital he thank you for the healing but we pray for complete healing and to be uh to be uh, discharged from that hospital lord father we praise you we thank you for each and every good things we experience and uh, we pray for lord many other people lord we thank you once again lord we also pray for craig as he celebrates his birthday and uh, we thankful for his life we thank you once again in jesus name amen god bless